Beautiful morning here in Santiago de Compostela. Wow. There's no um, adjective to properly describe this beautiful cathedral here, guys. In our room. Hi guys, good morning. Welcome to my channel Nathaniel Travels. We are here in the famous and one of the most beautiful cities here in Spain. Welcome to Santiago de Compostela. It is famous because of the pilgrimage Santiago uh, Camino Walk or Santiago Walk. It's so famous that this is the last uh, place, the, the place where they have the, the last stamp for the uh, Camino de Santiago. Unfortunately, we don't do yet the Camino de Santiago, but maybe in the future we're going to uh, experience the Camino de Santiago. So what can we do here in a day? So join me in this video. Again, this this is Nathaniel Travels. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't uh, subscribed yet. So the weather here is beautiful. So I am so excited and ready to uh, explore the beautiful city of Santiago de Compostela. They have a beautiful maze here. So here we go guys, let's go inside. <laughs> we're going to try first before we're going to explore the city. <laughs> Hey, hey, we found you. So we found him. So we're going to check our way out. I think it's easy, guys, to find the way out. So, <laughs> are we lost? <laughs> All right, guys, so we have found our way out so i think this one yay <laughs> successful first stop guys we have the uh, church of santo Fis de Solovio. it's the, the entrance is here but it's closed this is also one of the most uh, uh smallest and beautiful churches here in santiago de compostela this is the uh, Praza de Entre Prasinas. We are here at Praza da Universidade. This is the uh, University of Salamanca. I think it's Sciences and History um, Department. So the um, building is really uh, huge and beautiful. And you can see here a group of people touring around the city. And this is the church of the university. We're going inside. We just came out from the university church and it's free to go inside. There's no uh, entrance because normally there's an entrance. And right next to the university church is the Arco de Masarelos. This is the um, Arco de Masarelos. This one. It says here, Nesta Praza transcurrió a infancia boa parte de vida do jornalista compostelan José Luis Rey Alvite Martínez. We are going to a convent in a church, Das Orfas. This is the church and convent of Das Orfas. Now guys, we are uh, in front of the uh, church of Santa Maria Salome. It is closed so we cannot go uh, inside 
But this is the facade, the entrance, and the um, tower over there. And this is the surroundings of the Church Santa Maria Salome Church. There are some stalls here um, selling for um, leather items in this um, street. Street, they call it Rua. Rua is a street. Or, or in Spanish, it's Calle. But here, they call it Rua since it is near um, Portugal and Portuguese is Rua. But they speak here Gallego. Hi, this is the Plaza do Tural. So this is the main street guys and we have here a walk it is called Paso de Vaamonde if I pronounce it correctly. So it's very um, narrow. Maybe it's like a 200 meter walk, a narrow walk. This is Paso da Baamonte. <laughs> very narrow. There are some shops here and restaurants going to this um, walk. So this is the uh, Rua do Vilari Street. This is, I think, the most important street here in um, Santiago de Compostela because it will lead you to the uh, cathedral, the Santiago Cathedral. So we're going to follow this street. It goes to the cathedral. There are so many uh, people here going to the uh, the cathedral. Actually, you can see here the cathedral. The cathedral is there. That's the uh, cathedral. We have here a jewelry store, um, souvenir shop, cafe and restaurants, um, alley hall, and there's more, more restaurants and more buildings. All buildings turn into a um, shopping district. The Ben Vido. Rua do Vilar. Guys, from here we can see the... Um, I think this is the clock tower or Torre de Relo. Right from this street. Amazing view. We're getting closer guys. <laughs> it's so windy guys. So finally we have arrived. So we have here the horses fountain or Fonte dos Caballos. And we have here the uh, clock tower. This one is the clock tower or the Torre de Relo and this is the Cathedral of Santiago de Compostela it's so huge So we're near the entrance guys, so these are the information here, things that you cannot uh, bring inside and some stops.
pero sí, 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 por ahora sí. Eh, y por el alma y llegar perfecto a que se So we're back guys. Alright guys, so we just um, came out from the cathedral. There is another queue if you want to um, to touch the the relic of Santiago. So we're going to uh, to um, fall in line this queue and we're going back inside. Welcome to Santiago de Compostela Cathedral. This is the Cathedral of Santiago de Compostela. Very huge and there's lots, it's very famous. There's lots of people, tourists, not only here in Spain but also from other parts of the world. So this is the uh, Praza de Can the Quintana de Mortos. Wow. There is no um, adjective to properly describe this beautiful cathedral here, guys. Going inside is a mass. Again, it's free. This is the square guys um, at the back of the cathedral and this is one Beato Dos house or building. This is the uh, Obradoiro square guys. This is the San Fractoso Church. Yeah, we can go out uh, inside. And this is near to the uh, police station of uh, Santiago. This is the uh, Santa Susana church in a mountain near the um, the Mirador de Santiago or the viewpoint of Santiago it is located in a small hill alright guys so Santa Susana church is open they have a holy communion every um, Sunday to Friday I think it's 4 p.m. So I'm not sh sure if it's uh, an hour um, mass, but it's free. You can go here. So this is right next to the Mirador or the viewpoint of um, Santiago de Compostela. Okay, so again, Santa Susana is located here at the Alameda Park. This is Fonseca Square, guys. Plaza de Fonseca or Plaza de Fonseca. We are now at the Obradoiro Square or Plaza de Obradoiro. This is the Rajoy uh, building. So this is the end of the uh, Camino de Santiago or the Santiago Walk. 
So if you are going to do the Camino de Santiago, this is your final destination. Whether you take the, whether any route you will take, you will lead to this uh, point. This is the the end point. So there are so many people, groups that are um, heading to this place, uh, taking a rest and enjoying their uh, journey their um, experience their adventure so they take photo and they rejoice um, for the like like a reward of what they have done so you can see them here there's like various groups and many um, organizations they came from different uh, um, places of Spain and the world as well. I have seen people here from Brazil, from Mexico, and of course from from Spain. So you can see them here at this um, square. This is the um, convent and church of San Francisco. Plaza de Cervantes That's the end of our video guys. Thank you so much for joining me in this video as we discover the historical, amazing and famous city of Santiago de Compostela. I hope one day you can also do the Camino de Santiago or Santiago de um, Santiago Walk here in Spain, in the northern part of Spain. Again, this has been Nathaniel Chavels, so please uh, share this video if you like it and please do subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet to my channel thank you so much hasta luego from santiago de compostela this is the train station of santiago de compostela